as you see by the title um thumb 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 thumbnail i literally just woke up um i am exhausted it's like 4 50 something about to be 5 in the morning because i'm going to disneyland <clears throat> I haven't been to Disneyland since last year. Yep, last year on this month, but on the 5th of June. Today's the June 6th, so, um, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do this get ready with me, do my makeup with me, and I'll show you guys my outfit and everything. It's just a customized shirt and some jeans. I'm finally wearing jeans to freaking Disneyland. I usually wear tights or spandex shorts, so, yeah just to be comfortable but this time i wanted to go like a little bit dressed up because i want to take pictures differently because yeah but anyway let's get this makeup done because honestly i don't feel like doing makeup but i will do content for you guys so here i am so this is a get ready with me and then i'll have the vlog out after this video so um yeah so let's start off with sunscreen sunscreen because i'm gonna be out this real day and i don't know the sun has been in and out honestly it's been very gloomy lately just that sunday the sun was out oh you know what i forgot about my makeup pad <laughs> okay This white one in. And then it's dirty. Alright, we got all the make all the hair out the way. Now we're gonna go in the primer. You guys know the routine. Primer from Rare Beauty. A couple things from Rare Beauty, as you will see in this video. Now, I'm not gonna lie, this primer was like, I tried so many primers, but I like this one so much. And then I'm gonna go, I, this one's the one that's old, and I got a new one, but it's like two different shades. Got this one a little bit darker, this one's lighter. But I only use this under, I put this first to cover up my eye bags, because freak man. And the best concealer is Tarte. I've been using this for years now and it's never let me down. <laughs> so I usually do my um concealer. And then I put on um, a contour. I just thought this tonic was a little bit easier. I go in with the Burt Beauty Foundation in the shade 230 and I went down, this was 260 on the warmer side and I wore 230. So, I wake up early. Because we're supposed to be out the house by 7 in this game to be at the park once it opens. Colors for Colors Concealer. This has been doing me wonders. I need to cover up those eye bags. <laughs> I'm 
go in with the Tarte Translucent Powder. I don't really use this. I use this because it's just too pretty to mess up. And let me put it right here. To mattify my freaking face. Because I don't like when my makeup is dewy. It just, I hate it. been having this for years and I'm still not done with it. I remember buying two. But I don't know where the other one's at. Cause I like to be stocked up on makeup. So in case I run out, like I the powder I was running out and I was like, no, I need to get it. So I got it just in time. So where I wanted to start getting makeup Tarte could not explain because he had got a package Tarte of different shades of foundation so I was like oh cool so I ended up getting it so then now we're gonna brown the face so we won't look so pale this this has been with me for years like you have no freaking idea <laughs> this is what i like to do so i'm gonna put the rare beauty blush in the shade grace this is very pigmented like you have no freaking idea I don't even put that much and it's freaking pigmented and then I'm gonna mix it in with the Rare Beauty Enchant Glow and then put it right here or sometimes when it's very pigmented I just like I don't know what the fuck to do with it hopefully it mixes through perfectly and fine because honestly it's very pigmented you see that you see that But I don't want to look like a clown with too much. Just enough that gives me color. I never liked blush. But then I wanted to try it because I was like, well, why not? Okay. So I'm gonna use this palette. This palette has been with my makeup era for so long. So what I like to do to give it more like a bright look, I like to get my brush and then spray it with some of this. And then, and then tap it. I'm gonna spray myself with this one first. This is a Mario Bettisku, and I, I love this. This actually works wonders because I have tried Urban Decay, and I think I saw for setting spray. And then I started getting into Mario because 
this one. I really like how it left my skin. And I'm gonna air dry it. And I'm gonna go in with this one. This one's one size until dawn, mattifying waterproof setting spray. So this, I tried it and honestly it works wonders because I used it when I went to knots. So we're in for a ride, ladies. So it kind of has like a smell to it, but it works wonders. So I'm gonna do my eyelashes off camera and I'll be right back. And I did my freaking eyelashes off camera because, yeah, not the best, but now we're gonna get into freaking my hair. I'm just gonna shave in it, honestly. Nothing too drastic, because I think last year I had waved it, but it was hot last year, like you have no idea, so I'm just gonna straighten it for the hell of it. And on, let's see, so I'm gonna take this off, do my head. straight. See the difference? <coughs> Bless me. Thank you. make sure because I don't like when I see curls on my head
Okay, I'm gonna put my hair up. Meanwhile, I get dressed. And yeah. I'm gonna keep the flat iron on just in case. Just in case I wanna go over it. So let's get dressed. That I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna go put it on. Now I'm gonna put on my pants. I'm ready. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and tell the notification bell if you want to be notified when I upload. And I'll see you guys in the next video.